Are you gonna Wim Hof it, Brent? <laughs> si, senor. You're gonna get like proposals over the internet now. They're gonna be in no time. Marry me, Brent. <laughs> you big heady angel. <laughs> this is awesome. I can't believe you're doing this. I jump in there for 15 Mark, minutes. he does it to be a man, just to prove how manly he is. I'd like to point out there's six men here and only one is getting in <laughs> the water. Did your willy get bigger? <laughs> it kind of does. It, if anything, it's all in the head. Oh, this is unreal. Behind the scenes. Behind the scenes action of Wim Hof, right. 2016, Montana. The gritty brother-in-law right here. What's up, Bryce? I know you like cameras. Yeah, I love the camera. Yeah. <laughs> it's my favorite thing. <laughs> I think that's cheating. The, Let's the see you get in the water and tell me it's cheating. <laughs> the secret to Wim Hofing is simple. You consume about a gallon of water about 60 minutes before you hop in and you don't go to the bathroom and you just wait till you get in the water and then you just warm yourself up. <laughs> In other words, Brent's gonna um, take a pedal so in this pond. So, exactly how do you warm yourself up? Don't act like you've never peed in a pool, bro. Don't even give me that. There's like six cameras here. <laughs> so, so aren't you afraid that there's like some like things that are gonna go up the urinary tube? There? That's only in Africa. I, there's nothing in America. I googled this because I, I do this every day in a pond in Oregon. Yeah. And it's spring fed. We have newts and stuff that'll like crawl along my jimmy and stuff when I'm in the water and that's a little unnerving but didn't you also get trichinosis good, too? Trichinosis was didn't, from didn't, eating bear. It's nothing to do with the pond. But you knew you had to cook. Look, you can take health hundred. advice from this guy. Yeah, <laughs> okay, wait a minute. Okay, so how long have you been doing Wim Hof? A little over two months. And so you're going through a little withdrawal like you haven't got your ice. I haven't done it in like three days and like yesterday I was feeling super sluggish. Really sluggish. All right, dude. Let's uh, let's see this thing. All right. I want to see that hairy back. <sighs> you want to see it? Here. <laughs> Take it off like a model does. <laughs> <laughs> How do you do that? I don't know, brother. You like my Superman triangle? Yeah, I do. People think I have tattoos. <laughs> <laughs> Those are wings of... <laughs> Normally you breathe before you get in. So much for that bloody water you drank, eh? <laughs> it takes a while to get used to it before you can pee yourself. What's the temperature? It's clenching too tight. It's got to unravel. It's cold. You know it got down to like 30 last night, right? So that water's probably in the 30s. <laughs> yeah, it burns. It's just the ear. Yeah, it's not a... Low 40. It's a painful cold. It, it burns a bit. Are you peeing yet? Are you peeing I yet? haven't gotten to it yet. No, I haven't mustered up the... I have a shy bladder. It's stage, uh, stage fright? Yeah. Too many people watching. It might not happen. I might have to wait till I get out. Find me a good bush. Yeah, I say go for about 10 minutes. That'll probably be good. Wow. <sighs> swim it. I'll swim it at the end. Swimming sucks. <laughs> yeah, see that's the other trick is you don't move if you can help it. What, what helps the most is when you get in the water, your heart rate naturally slows. And so it helps keep your heart pumping and to keep you warm. <laughs> How about when people throw rocks at you? That yeah, was zero. Really that that was That's a new one. Loving That's, Scottish. Is that I, uh, well, oh, blame the bloody foreigner. <laughs> I've only ever done this with one other person. Just packs in for the Highland Games. <laughs> I have been able to convince uh, really? other people to join me. <sighs> Normally you know, what I do is... Head down? Brent. Well, we're go under the water. Come That's, on. I've done this before. I've done this with you. You did it with me for five minutes. You did, you're right. I've seen your brother do up in, on the top of a mountain in a yeah, bloody for some cold reason, river, like, and he didn't do it every day up in the mountains in the ice cold. 
But just to do it otherwise, I don't know, man. It's tough. <laughs> just to bathe, right? Yeah. <laughs> if we were all in there with you, you wouldn't have a film crew. Yeah. Completely. Multi this is really important to document. Well, you're trying to say we're, 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 we're changing the world yeah, here. Right? Yeah. Brent's Brown trying to develop food. brown fat <laughs> tissue. Right? It's brown fat. Right, Brent? Yes. Okay. Yeah. Babies have brown fat. <laughs> but we can't eat them because you got that trichiosis stuff. <laughs> so what's the use of it? brown or white fat, does it? <laughs> brown fat is more resilient to cold. White fat only <laughs> develops once you're in your teens. Oh, okay. So, I mean, it's literally a... A uh, side effect of our Put environment. On him. I bet you three, four hundred years ago, most people did not have white fat. They had brown fat. So they're. He has no freaking idea. He's just guessing. He Googled it. Look, I'm the one in the water. <laughs> I think he is the expert. <laughs> so far, my butt's in the water. At first, though, I, it was literally just like five minutes of shaking and shivering for probably the first week. Dude, when I do it, and I get in there with him, he hits this serenity point. It never comes for me. It, and pretty soon there's this uncontrollable shaking. Like, really? my yeah. legs start, I'm trying to hold it from not shaking, but I, I hate being cold, but I'm, I, I would be interested in trying it sometime. It's a mental challenge, dude. Yeah. Get your clothes off now and get in with them. I'll use your clothes. I'll get in the water, I'll go down and get a light kayak out of the garage. <laughs> but if you go down, I ain't getting in there for you. I'll tell mom you said you love yeah, her. Yeah, Wim Hof says to be careful because you could pass out. And then he freaking does it. He's in the in the water. He does it like in the freaking river in Norway. Shouldn't you put your shoulders underneath the water? <laughs> Mark, I'm having, there's like, I'm on a hillside right here. I have my knees down. I'm propping myself up on my knees. So. He's just being a wimp. Just, uh, usually he goes it. a little deeper. <gasps> that a boy. Yeah, Once go. it hits the neck, that's when it really starts we're to get still painful. Not under. Okay, have so you ever watched Wim? Real, he's like this in the water, and he's like, down. I'm a badass. Well, you should be more than him. Get your uh, beard wet. Yeah, he <laughs> ran 26 miles, a marathon, in a freaking desert without drinking water. He had a cup of coffee for breakfast. That's, yeah, I'm not on Wim level. <laughs> W-I-M-H-O-F. Oh, you don't see that fella? I mean, it's, he's amazing. Like, <sighs> My feet hurt, which is not normal. This water's a lot colder, and uh, normally I can get my feet inside some mud. <laughs> little, little, uh, what's the word I'm thinking of? Insulation. I think. Well, it's I see something swimming towards you. <laughs> Is that the Loch Ness monster? <laughs> but hey, you got snakes in uh, Montana. It's here because of the Scottish guy. Yeah, you it wants snakes. him, not me. Some big fish in here, sucker fish. Big sucker fish. <laughs> <laughs> It looks easy, Brent. It looks really easy. Yeah, but the moment I stop to talk to you guys, my butt starts shaking. So Until meditate. I start breathing again. That's true, dude. The Just breathing is going. like key. Run, run and you going. start breathing like this, and then it translates into- Breathing is key. Like, you're uh, Wim was and asked- And everything else, too. By Tim Ferriss, if you had a billboard in the world, what would you put on it? Well, he said breathe, mother effer, in his cute little Norwegian accent, but yeah, breathe. I'm sure the Norwegians like that it's a cute little accent. It is cute. It is. I think that's body shape. Yeah. <laughs> She's right, it is. <laughs> Bloody <laughs> Braveheart, and I got Norwegian cousins. They talk real cute. <laughs> when are we going to go hunt reindeer, Mark? Reindeer? I yeah, know. Don't, you don't you have cousins in Finland? No, Norway and Denmark. Don't they have reindeer? Same thing, right? Finland, yeah, Norway, Denmark, Denmark same Norway, thing. Norway. Kind of, kind of the South same thing Africa. between Scotland and <laughs> Ireland. South Africa, Paraguay. Same. Paraguay? Yeah. Where's Paraguay? <laughs> it's Paraguay. It's Paraguay. Paraguay? Oh. <laughs> I lived with a guy from, from Paraguay. <laughs> I lived with a guy from Paraguay. Yeah, he did. He didn't have a septic tank system, so he would never flush his used toilet paper. You yeah, know, throw it in the yeah, trash. Throw it in the trash. Oh. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Our chondo. We don't do that here. <laughs> yeah. You can flush it. Yeah. And that's the way it still is. Over there. Yeah, I just dude. Got back right. from Costa Rica. Very it's the same way. Conscious of saving the earth. Well, they didn't have the flushable toilets. Yeah. Yeah. They they have like they have garbage septic tank systems. 
He's also deathly afraid of spiders. We got the Black Widow and we threw it in his room to strengthen no, his manhood. Behind, <laughs> Doing him a favor, were ya? <sighs> they, they, like, they don't have spiders down there, but they have like four foot long praying mantis. They're like this school mascot was like a two foot long white praying mantis. <laughs> the heck is that? Had pink eyes, it's all boogly. Hey, I need to go pee, I'll warm it up for you. <laughs> <laughs> hey, give me the camera. <laughs> I'll film you. Start playing some 70s bass. Bump, <laughs> bump, <laughs> And then Nima Steven playing with all fiddling in the pot. <laughs> I think he gets stung by a jellyfish. We're all busy behind him. It's <laughs> like splashing up on it. <laughs> he, he can't do it. He doesn't want to move. He doesn't want to back up. What's your time, Bryce? It's been like nine minutes. Oh, it's yeah. been three minutes, you wish. <laughs> We've got eight, eight another minutes 25 minutes to go. He's got another minute. He's going 10. A real man could go an hour. <laughs> Lim does it for three. He owes the world record in China in an ice bath. Like they put like ice, ice in a tub. Ice, oh, full I on saw ice, it. like it's saw mostly it. ice. I saw it on, on He's it's like, amazing. my low back's feeling cold. Mm, now it's warm. <laughs> like he says, he can send heat to the different parts of his body. Yeah. Supposedly, doing this along with the breathing exercises can actually change your body chemistry to be more alkaline and helps you tap into your <laughs> what he calls your autonomic brain, which is like your nerve system, the thing that pumps out adrenaline. Oh, I gotta get some footage of this for Facebook. Like <laughs> All right, Jesse, we're doing a little Wim Hof here with Brent. Yeah. I say we in the most uh, <laughs> supportive <laughs> sense possible. Sense of the word. Go, Brent. How many seconds has it been? Seconds. <laughs> Stay in your minute. Be chat thingy. I got to take a picture. He's at his 10 minute mark. 10 minutes. What you're supposed to do is box Stop. breathing. <laughs> That's a beauty. <laughs> That's a beauty. <laughs> You're not worthy to wear a kilt, man. 11 and a half. I go to 15. You can't even put it in your kilt. Come on now. All right, we got other things to do. <laughs> We gotta get, we gotta we got, get Mark home. He's a busy man. We got things made right. fun of you, so. All right, let's go. He's swimming. Skin's a little. He gonna swim? <sighs> Not much of a swimmer. Oh, you're like a mermaid, you. <laughs> <laughs> Look at you. <laughs> Dolphin, come on. You'll just float. <gasps> go under and kick up. Come out in the water. Out there? there you go. Oh. Atta a boy. <laughs> Woo! Is it cold? You're like an orca coming out of the water. <laughs> or like do a good mermaid. <laughs> Tell you, I'm like, it's like a sea waddle. Sea waddle, look at you. <laughs> like a sea waddle. Sea waddle, look at you. What's your charge admission? <laughs> That's brilliant, man. Well done, right? <laughs> the bears. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, brother. <laughs> Thanks. So, how do you feel now that you're out of the water? Not sleepy. After well, four no hours. Kidding, dude. <laughs> Not sleepy. You feel refreshed. cold? Do you feel refreshed? The key is you have to move afterwards. No, I don't feel cold. I'm numb. I can't feel much of anything. <laughs> <laughs> and you subject yourself to this on a daily basis? On purpose. Yeah. So this I know, water was colder though? I will say this water was colder, but the water back home is coming out of the ground. It's not coming off a mountain. So I mean, it's coming straight out of the ground from like, oh, it is a spring. We're in Montana, so I'm gonna give it to him. It's probably colder, <laughs> but yeah, I do it every day. It's been really good and I don't see myself stopping. I'm addicted. I got water in my ear. That was a bad move. Dude, you look like a mermaid, man. Like a true merman. Just beautiful. Merman. <laughs> Graceful. There's no such thing, bro. <laughs> All right, Mark. Are you ready to start doing it, too? Uh, Mark's no. so pumped, he's ready to do it now. Next through the episode, yes. we all do it from Merman. the pond. 
extra gritty. Jeezy. Mer Sasquatch. Mer Squatch. The Mer Squatch. There's some hairy wings on that back. Mer Squatch. Sorry. Mer Squatch. The next The next gritty tip's going to be. Yeah, Mark. the next gritty tip we're going to get from Mark. Mark, and he's going to do the Wim Hof. He's going to show everyone else how to do it. Gritty tip number. This is great. I think you should. Volunteer and everybody else. Oh, yeah, that's <laughs> a good idea. Yeah, yeah. Bollocks to you. Well, you, you, 